Matt Brown here for playpicks.com taking a look at this big Thursday night football game between the Vikings and the Rams two teams of course everybody very very high on heading into this season the Rams going out and just absolutely crushing people to open up this season the Vikings looking pretty good until last week where they laid a complete egg against the Buffalo Bills looking to bounce back here on Thursday night but let's take a look over in New Jersey and see how this is looking from a betting perspective in this game Uh, coming down here taking a look at the lines uh, pretty much across the board we got the same thing taking a look at uh, DraftKings Sportsbook we got the Rams at 749 and a half same deal at FanDuel same deal at BetStars Rams seven point favorites here with a 49 and a half point total real big story coming into this game Akib Tlaib has been moved to the IR of course a Very, very key part of that defense for the Rams there. Just a really, really good cornerback. And then their other corner, Marcus Peters, is actually questionable heading into this one. He was able to get in, as you can see right here, a limited practice on Wednesday. So they're hoping he's going to be able to go. But man, that would be another big, big blow for this team as he's not able to go. And Mark Barron is also questionable. All three of those guys are out. That could be some trouble for this Rams team, even if Dalvin Cook doesn't suit up. Dalvin Cook questionable. He was able to get some reps in on Wednesday, so maybe he will be able to suit up on Thursday. I know last week he was at least verbal in saying that he thought he was going to be able to go on Thursday night, so we will see. Of course, if he's not able to go, that means Latavius Murray is going to be going in this one. Now, look, this is one of those situations where if both of the corners happen to be out for the Rams, of course, you have those stud wide receivers on the Vikings side you've got Stefan Diggs you've got Adam Thielen you got two guys that can really really light it up and if they're going against backup corners you got to really like that matchup there for these guys no joke that is going to be something I'm going to be watching right up until kickoff of course you know we get the injury report about 90 minutes before so we'll have time to adjust and see how things go with all of that so you've got both of those guys and of course you have Kyle Rudolph as well as guys that we can look at here for uh for, for this passing game Come down a little bit further. I mean, one of the things we're going to be watching here, Minnesota is going to be without Everson Griffin as well. I'm sure you maybe have seen this whole story where they actually have checked him in for some psychological evaluations and stuff like that. I mean, he's a, he's a beast when he's on the field, but going to be without him. So that could be a, a pretty big, a pretty big hurt for that defense. Still pretty stout, but man, Todd Gurley, it doesn't really matter now, does it? I mean, it's when it's Todd Gurley, he's pretty much matchup proof whenever it comes to things that are going on. Uh, in the NFL with these game, with these defenses and stuff like that. They use him so well. They use him in the passing game. They, they create different little ways to get the ball in his hands. So uh, Todd Gurley uh, certainly could, can take advantage of just about any matchup there. But this Rams offense is what really is, is, has surprised me so far. I knew it was going to be good. I didn't know it was going to be this good. The addition of Brandon Cooks obviously is a, is a big thing there. But Robert Woods just continues to perform and Cooper Cup is that security blanket that Jared Goff is always looking for. And, uh, man, so far this season, this certainly looks like the team to beat. Of course, as I mentioned earlier, they are the Super Bowl favorites in this one. So basically what it comes down to is how are you going to bet this game? How do you think that this game is going to play out? Hate to do this to you because I know you tune into this video for for picks here, but really it's going to have a lot to do with how this defense shakes out on the Rams side here. I mean, if, if Peters is not able to go and Barron is not able to go, I'm certainly going to take the points with the Vikings in this one. I mean, this just seems like a a pretty big spread catching seven, you know, you're getting seven points with this Vikings team. It's got a pretty good defense of their own and certainly has an offense that can move the ball, especially against backups for the Rams. So certainly something I'm going to be looking at in, in this game is going to be uh, leaning towards the Vikings side here. I don't like the Rams really at all at seven. So I'm not going to be playing the Rams side either way. And I'll certainly be looking to play the Viking side should one of these injuries kind of break over there. If you take a look right here, one of the interesting things, 60% of the money is actually taking the points so far with the Vikings on this one. So 60% of the money that's been bet on this game is taking the plus seven. It's kind of a pros versus Joe's scenario when we're looking at the the over-under here. So we got 60% of the bets on the over, but then you have 60% of the money on the under. So I think this is one of those things where the sharps are looking at this and thinking that this might be a little bit more of a defensive game than people think at this one, guys, be sure and head to playpicks.com. You can take a look at this article as well. If you want to read further uh, into the breakdown of the game and everything like that. And of course you can take advantage of all of our uh, sign up offers, all of our sign up bonuses and things like that. If you go to playpicks.com, I'll take a, I'll show you right here. Playpicks dot com backslash bonus 
just backslash bonus right there. You can take a look at everything that we have to offer uh, from a sports betting bonus perspective, a no deposit bonus perspective, and even from a a DFS perspective. uh, One of the very best bonuses you're ever going to see Actually, the best online that you can find right now, right here, is a $25 free at DraftKings Sportsbook. No deposit necessary, so all you have to do is click right here, this Play Now, and you are going to, once you sign up for an account, you're going to get $25 to bet with, no deposit necessary. So really great stuff there. Of course, we have bonuses at FanDuel, we have bonuses at BetStars, we have bonuses at 888, and if you like to play DFS, we've just got DraftKings DFS as well. Again, that's Play Picks dot com black backslash bonus guys enjoy thursday night football and we'll be back for all of our picks for this week on sunday